you may have put together an emergency go bag or even just thought about it. The idea is that when a crisis hits, you'll have access to resources that you'll need. This may include a first aid kit, some clothing, and canned food. But what tech should you include in your survival kit? No matter who you are, you deserve to be private, secure, and free. Join us for tips on how to stay protected on and offline. Today we'll be walking through the steps for creating a tech pouch that you can include inside your existing survival backpack. So you'll want to opt for a small pouch or a bag that's both durable and waterproof, or at the very least, water resistant. Your kit should be able to withstand rough treatment. Portable power banks. A good power bank will last a few months unused on a full charge. As always, opt for something waterproof. Cables. It's a good idea to have both data transfer and charging USB cables. This is because while you can use both for charging your devices, some cables aren't so great for data transfer. For safety, you want to ensure that you use cables purely designed for charging devices if you happen to be using a publicly provided USB slot, like the ones in train stations, cafes, and airport lounges. Investing in several universal or travel power adapters is a great way to ensure that you can easily charge your device no matter where you are in the world. You'll also want to consider options that include fast charging ports. Secondary mobile phones. A cheap secondary phone can come in handy if you're abroad and you still want to use your primary SIM card while roaming. It can also serve as an emergency device if your primary phone is damaged. Prepaid SIM card kits. A prepaid SIM card with preloaded credit can be used on your secondary phone. Most kits come with adapters with various SIM types and a SIM injector, which is absolutely invaluable. If possible, opt for a SIM card with international allowances. Pocket Wi-Fi Hotspot The upside to a portable pocket Wi-Fi hotspot is that you don't have to worry about draining your smartphone's battery while tethering. A good pocket Wi-Fi hotspot can support between 10 to 15 devices at the same time. Screwdriver Kits Screwdriver kits are a killer asset to your tech survival arsenal. While they're compact, they contain so many useful tools that it's hard to imagine not purchasing one. Pocket Knives Multi-tool pocket knives, like Swiss Army knives, are perfect for stripping and cutting cables, opening packages, and general tech repairs. Lighting. A good headlamp or neck light is invaluable when doing tech repairs in less than ideal conditions. You also can't go wrong with a good torch. Go with something compact, waterproof, and with at least 200 lumens. Diving watch. An analog diving watch is the perfect timekeeper for your survival kit. It won't need to be charged, unlike a digital or smartwatch, and a new battery replacement can last up to several years. You'll want to have three USB flash drives handy. The first one should include important documents like passports, birth certificates, deeds, licenses, insurance information, and possibly accreditations. Remember, always encrypt this particular drive. Now, the second drive should be used as a medical flash drive. The idea is to create an unencrypted flash drive with your medical information that can be used in an accident. Information should include your name, emergency contacts, blood type, no medical conditions, and your medical history. The last flash drive should be used for portable operating systems. A lightweight portable Linux distribution could come in handy as a safe way to use a computer that's not yours while traveling. Just plug it into a computer and it'll be like using your own. External solid state drives. You never know when you might need backup for larger files. Solid state drives are preferable as they're much faster and more durable than traditional external hard drives. Also throw in a few SD cards, readers and adapters on the off chance you'll need to access files from older storage devices. There you have it. We hope you found this guide useful. What would you include in your tech survival kit? Let us know in the comments below. For more tips on how to take control of your privacy, visit expressvpn.com.